everyone. Our force should be here any moment now. We will find out. Some announcements before we begin. Sorry, we're like half an hour late from our 8 o'clock start time we're going to be, but generally we start at 7.30, so we're an hour late technically. Oh boy. Uh, Tiltify, our charity of choice is Color of Change. Donate if you can, it's a really great charity. It does a lot of good stuff. Color of Change, it's our links in all of our VODs, podcasts, streams. You can find our lat link anywhere to donate. Patreon, $3 tier, gives you supplemental content for your D&D campaigns. That's all I'm going to say because we're late. So... Last we left off, <gasps> you entered a mere <laughs> version of Baldur's Gate. It's fucking weird. Backwards walking people, flying skin curtains. Entered a library full of mirrors. People were in the mirrors that you've seen before. Then their skin was getting pulled off. Ty almost stepped fully into a mirror, which has been character death. Because they are basically, yeah, that's what would have happened. Um, found a puppet named Billy. Ventriloquist dummy who's been hanging out here for a while. Y'all went through a secret door that no one had gone through. Met a flying meat curtain man. He told you that there was a to there was like this doorway, portal. The portal led to the domains of Dread, aka Ravenloft, but specifically to one of the domains known as Lamordia, which is full of steam creations and body parts mangled together and stitched together and melded together. Yada 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 yada. You were given a task to take this armored tank that these people were developing to test it out to the city of New Furchtenberg to deal with a warped monstrosity threat attacking the city. And that's where we are, driving through a forest of frost and rust. As a bunch of ice spiders, seven of them descend from the ceiling. Hubert, Anastasia, and Ty are strapped into open-faced uh, ballista seats. They do not count as cover. But yet, regardless, strapped to those on top of the tank while Jakith and Billy the Puppet are snug and safe inside the tank. And since everybody already rolled initiative, we're going to get started with the ice spiders. <laughs> they're first? Yeah, they're first. Oh, panic. Besties, right. we really bungled this one up. Alrighty, so... <laughs> hi, we're live. Just so you know. If you're here. We haven't had a long rest for like... No, you haven't had a long three rest. Three sessions. That's right. Correct. Uh, okay. So, yeah, we're in initiative. Just so you know, Brittany, Ty has a five for initiative right now. Just so you know. <laughs> So, one of the first ice spiders is about, like I said, the people on top. The ice spiders are about five feet above you based on the treetops in the tank. So, this ice spider is just going to shoot a web at. Who doesn't want to shoot a web at? Nah, no, you're within, within melee. Why would it shoot a web? It's going to go for Anastasia because it can sense the valley girl and doesn't like it. So, <laughs> that's a 10 to hit. You look very attacked. A 10 will hit. Nice. So that's nine piercing damage. Rude. And I need you to make a con save. Nah. Yeah, please. <laughs> As this big spider made of solid ice just bites into you. A six? <laughs> uh, you take 11 poison damage. Oh, man. Why do you do beyond crashed after that? <laughs> okay, you're at 10 of 30 hit points. <laughs> uh, so we're going to bring us to another ice spider because they all rolled very well for initiative that's going to try biting Hubert what haunts you pretty one uh, and yes the stats for the ballistas that you're all restrained or grappled inside of are in the discord uh, so the spider biting Hubert got a 23 to hit Duh, it's... okay for 5 piercing damage all right. And you are not raging. Yep. Correct. Uh, and then con save. That is a spicy 11. That just succeeds, so you take half the poison damage, so you take 5 instead of 10. Woo! Brings us to another ice spider. <laughs> they all rolled so well. But also, y'all didn't roll great. Uh, so this ice spider is going... Them. This ice spider is going to attack Ty for the bite attack. That's a dirty 20 to hit, which hits Ty. Ty takes 10 piercing damage. Uh, Ty. Gotta check something here. 
Everyone relax. Oh, I think D&D Beyond's having issues. Yeah, sorry. I thought my dad was dying. We're good. <laughs> One sec. Oh, yeah, D&D Beyond's having issues, y'all. <laughs> Woo! It's a vibe. It's okay. If anybody can try to refresh in their character sheet right now, that'd be cool. I don't think it's going to work. I just tried closing D&D Beyond and opening it again. All right, well, this is... Have you tried plugging it in? This is going to be interesting. <laughs> oh, here we go. Hi. Well, I've got roll 20 up. I could just do some rolls there if needed. I'm keeping Okay, my, my character sheet is good. There we yeah. go. Okay, maybe it's just me that can't load D&D Beyond then. Okay. Uh, are you resistant to poison damage, or do you have anything against resisting poison, Ty? Yes, resistant to poison. Do you have advantage on making poison saves? Yes. Okay, then make a con save with advantage. Nat 20. So you take half or 26. The you take half the poison damage, and then you take half of it because you're resistant. So 8 poison damage reduced to 4 reduced to 2. So 2, two poison damage, unless oh, you're immune nice. to poison damage. No, just immune to disease. Okay. That brings us to the fourth of the seven ice spiders, or four of the six ice spiders. This one's going to attack Hubert. 16 to hit. That hits. Okay. Uh, six piercing damage. Owie. And con save again. Natural 20. So half damage, you take 14 reduced to 7 poison damage. Ow. Bringing us to that Hubert. Been a toughie. Uh, bonus action rage. All right. Because fuck all that. Um, well beyond, uh, uh, well under like half hit points now uh, for after all that. Um, and I guess I'm gonna try firing this thing. What? What's my to hit on this? I posted it in the group chat. Oh shit! I guess I missed that. Oh fuck. Uh, plus six. Plus to six. Hit. Okay, thank you. All right. Uh, then I will do. Uh, I will pretend it's a heavy crossbow then, because my heavy crossbow is a plus six to hit. All, All right. right. That's a twenty-five. Twenty-five to hit. Roll 3d10, and it's no mo no bonuses to the damage, just 3d10. Alright. 15. Alright. And I'm sh you're shooting one of the two that are attacking you, I imagine. Oh. Oh, shit. It would be a disadvantage, wouldn't it? Because Man, they're within melee range. I don't care. Okay. They're big enough that it doesn't really matter. Alright. <laughs> so I assume you're attacking one of the two that's attacking you. Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Um, All right. Uh, actually, no, no, sorry. I'll be attacking the one that's on uh, Anastasia. All right, yeah, she's looking real bad. All right, boom, that one's looking real bad now as it gets walloped by this ballista bolt. Now Hubert is out of ammunition. That's bonus action action. Jakith! Okay. Or wait, oh, Jakith should have went first. I'm, Oops. Oh, okay. I'm, okay. I'm terribly sorry, Justin. Does that use... Your Does, bonus action is, was to rage, and you, you don't get multiple attacks with this because it's your action is okay because it uses my action to attack with the ballista. Okay, Correct thank you. Rondo. That's what that's what my question was about. Excellent, thank you. Yeah, yeah Jakith should have went first. Oops. Oh, well, I can okay. change initiative now. You know what? I want to put Jakith at fourteen. There we go. You can edit initiative in the initiative tracker now. Yes. yes. Jakith. All right. Oh. Okay. Uh, I need to get Jakith's voice. Okay. Um, he is going to. Remember, an action. Your action is to activate two levers at once. Right. Uh, he's gonna look at Billy. Yeah. What's going on? Let's fucking kill these things. <laughs> yeah. Uh, fuck him. Fuck him. When the, fuck him. When more than two are out of their arrows or whatever, uh, pull that lever. Uh, okay. Down. He's gonna point to the fifth one. Sure. And he's going to, with one, he is going to yank down on the lever number six to reverse. Okay, so. Okay, I got it. You know what? I'm looking something up because technically the people in the ballistas are tech. Are they mounted? I'm going to say this is mounted. This technically mounted. 
Oh shit. Okay. Well then, they would. Yeah. That would be a tax opportunity then. Yeah. yeah. Shit. Okay, it's we'll technically, do that then. It's technically mounted combat for the Makes people sense. on top. Yeah. So are the okay? So we're are are they still in the tree? Like, are they on the actual tank? Are they in the spiders? The are in the trees still? Okay. Um, but he's everybody, going everybody to, on top is kind of like whacking their heads off of branches right now. He's going to use the crank. How the the cannon? What can I shoot? Can I shoot shoot something that's like attacking somebody? Yeah. The cannon, okay. the cannon has 360 degrees of turning and it can aim. Oh, perfect. So he's going to turn his little crank with right. his uh, lightning cannon, so seeing that Hubert has two. On top, just... Kind of looking like it's headed to Hubert. And it's going to settle on the first one that attacked him. Okay. And he's going to yell out, duck! And he's going to uh, fire. All right, roll a d20 plus eight. Oh, wow. And it's 10d10 lightning damage if it hits yeah that's a natural 20 uh so 20d10 <laughs> lightning damage or you can roll 10d10 and multiply it up to you 20d10 or 10d10 and multiply i'm gonna be a mess yes. and i'm gonna i'm gonna fuck up D D beyond and i'm gonna roll 20d10 yeah gonna here we go oh god please don't roll shit 92 <laughs> lightning damage <laughs> <laughs> That spider is just gone. The lightning, when it shoots, everyone's like temporarily blinded for like a couple seconds. Just <laughs> And Hubert, where that spider was, is no more. Good. <laughs> um, and, oh 92. shit, I lost my, I lost my thing, my craft. All right. Uh, he is going to... The lights are on. Uh, he Correct. is going to pull down on the lever that he just fired with. To reloads reload the, cannon. the candle. Yeah. All right. That's your, any bonus actions? I don't uh, think so. Uh... No. All right. Uh, one of the other ice spiders is going to drop onto the front window of the tank. <laughs> And it's going to try getting through the armor of the tank, which I have on here. It has an AC of 20. It has 350 hit points. Damage immunity, psychic poison, and psychic. So it's just going to try... That. It's going to attack the windshield. I'll keep track of the HP. Okay, cool. Uh, but a 13 doesn't hit. Fuck, no, it doesn't. Does not get through the armor. The other ice spider is going to leap on top of the tank scurry over to Ty and make a bite attack on Ty. Uh, yeah. And because these things are technically never leaving the 120 foot range, no attacks for opportunity. Oh, Ty, that's a natural 20. <laughs> Fighting. Alright, so that is 13 piercing damage and con save with advantage. Seventeen plus six. So that's half of the poison crit. And then reduce that as well. Half. So that's four D eight poison. That'll be thirteen poison reduced to six, reduced to three. That'll bring us to Anastasia. There is a spider right in front of you. Great. Love it. You can still I... use your spells, by the way. Just because your grapple doesn't mean you don't have access to your spells. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> mm. Oh, forgot to mention, the ballistas are also immune to poison and psychic. But the ballistas can also still be destroyed. <laughs> it's just a, like a flat plus six to roll, yep. right? Like yep. there's no strength involved in nope. this. Just d20 plus six. Great, because I am not strong. 
but also very much almost dead. And it's also a flat 3d10 if it hits. Mm. Alright, well, let's do, let's, do some, let's do some ballista. Alrighty. It's like clambering over your ballista. You, you can just... That's a 13 plus 6. 19 hits. So 3d10. And this one's already been hit by a ballista bolt, so... Seventeen damage. Alrighty, right through the abdomen and th <laughs> and it gets impaled to a tree. Any bonus actions? Seven bonus actions. That is a great question. Let's do it. I'm good. I'm gonna just hope I don't die. Okay, tie. There are two. Clambering around your ballista. So there's two. Sorry. There's two around me. Yep. Anastasia's looking like shit. Yep. So are you. <laughs> but Anastasia's looking a little bit worse. Yep. Oh no. Anastasia. Oh, but I could do. Oh, I could do that. Yeah. I'm going to Bo Bonus action healing word on Astasia. Okay. So you're gonna get uh max healing, so nine healing to you. And then is my action. Can I shoot the ballista? Yeah. yeah. Okay, we're gonna do that. Right. Don't do that. We got this. So it's just a d20 plus six. Yep. If the kid looks out the back window of the cockpit, this is what your kid sees ice spiders crawling all over the tank and. Nineteen. <laughs> Plus six, 25. That hits. And then it's just 3d10? Yep. 3d10. Where's the d10? Three. Roll. Oh. 18 damage. Oh, nice. All right. That one is looking real bad. Okay. And. That'd be it. When, uh. When. Hit when Ty healed Anastasia. Anastasia. Ty was just like, nin, 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 it's cute. Would not be happy if he died here. Alright. That's, that's their turn. Okay. Uh, Billy the Puppet. <laughs> oh, man. It's real bad out there. Uh, and he's gonna, doesn't matter what lever he pushed for the ballista, either up or down reloads them, so he's gonna reload all the spent ballistas, so Ty, Anastasia, and Hubert, your ballistas reload. And the other lever, I mean, I mean. He can shoot it. He's gonna aim the cannon. Cool. <laughs> and shoot, uh, one of the other ones that's messing with Hubert. That's a uh, dirty 20 to hit, which hits. So that's 10d10 lightning damage. And that is 61 lightning damage. So Hubert, again, flash of light. <laughs> and the other spider that was bothering you is also gone. Bringing us to the. Yes. There are one, two. One, two. Nice shot. Three spiders left. All right. Uh, that's both of Billy's action. That's Billy's action. Both levers. 
the ice spider that was the other ice spider that was dealing with Ty is gonna bite Ty for a seven to hit, bringing us to Jakith. Oh, I should we kill that mini? Okay. Uh, yeah. It's gonna kind of. It's gonna pat Billy on the back. Good job. Don't fucking touch pull, me. Move, and it'll pull down on the lever to reload it. You know, I don't need to move. I'm not heavy. Whatever. And it'll crank, 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 crank around okay, to... So your actions, the two levers, you're going to do reload the, the cannon and fire it? Yeah, and then okay. fire it. He'll crank it around to uh, Ty. Okay. And shoot Ty. What? Ty has two of them around. He'll uh, turn. Ty yeah, still right. has two, yeah. Yeah, let's go for the... Let's go for the uninjured one. Sounds like if there's it. Okay, I don't know if there's any... There's injured, one that's though. uninjured that's going on. Yeah, he'll go for that one then. Okay. And there's the one that's on the, the glass. Oh, that's not great. Uh, eight, 16? 16 hits. Oh, okay, cool. That's... Uh... Oh, I did, rolled the, I did the wrong initiative. The one that... The spider that just went was the one that was on the windshield, but it didn't hit anyway, so it's fine. All right. All right. Oh, God. Uh, 46? Lightning damage? 46 lightning damage to one of the ones that's messing with Ty. Yep. That one is also... <laughs> gone nice okay kind of like look around observe and see the others and then that will be his turn all right yeah. hubert all right so it's how many the, are left uh the one you can't see on the windshield because mm -hmm. i got that one's initiative order wrong and the injured one that's still attacking ty all right i'll take out i'll go aim for that one all right go for it Okie doke. Does a 15 hit? A 15 does hit. Woo! 3d10? Yep. Three. That's good. 24. That one is also shot off the, uh, off the, uh, like you're using the javelin gun from Dead Space 2. <laughs> nice. Ty, you alright? All right. Anything else? Uh, uh, let's see. No. Okay. Um. Uh. Well, when you score a critical hit with a melee weapon, or reduce a creature to zero HP with oh, with a melee weapon. Never mind. Never mind. Okay. Keep going. We're good. Done. Anastasia. You can't see the other spider. It's kind of on the windshield, out of your. On his sight. I'm going to take this momentous opportunity that I'm not dying to cast a little spell called Mage Armor. On myself. Okay. And that lasts for eight hours. Eight hours. All right. So use your action to cast mage armor. Yeah. Okay. Thirteen plus dex. Yep. Thirteen. Cool. Oh, ignore that. That is not a goal. Anything else? Just gonna be here. Looking pretty. All right, Ty. You can, you can't see the other spider. Uh, how bad does Hubert look? Uh, Hubert should be uh, better than yeah, better than everyone else, probably. Twenty five of fifty nine. Tyre at thirteen of forty one. Anastasia's at nineteen of thirty. Yeah. Plus, I've got rage going, so, and we're almost done with these guys, so. I was just going. Uh, maybe. Maybe. Fuck. Uh. Oh. Um. Oh yeah. 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 Let's wait. 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 Is that a higher? Oh no, that's just a first level spell. Ty's gonna. Bonus action. Look towards Anastasia. Mm -hmm. And just. 
looks towards them and just be, 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 be safe. Miss Q wants you to be safe. And they're going to cast Sanctuary on them. So, um, until the spell ends, any creature who targets the worded creature with an attack or harmful spell must first make a wisdom save Correct. on a failed save. Got to choose a new target. And also, I want to say that you can't attack from inside Sanctuary. What? Well, yeah. like, you can, but it'll get rid it'll of It'll get rid of Sanctuary. Yeah. yeah. I don't like this. <laughs> you can still do support abilities, though. I don't need support abilities. Okay, so doing? that's Ty's turn. Billy the dummy is going to lever, reload cannon, and reload ballistas. Uh, it will be the spider that's attacking the windshield. <laughs> it's going to try to attack the windshield. Actually, it's seeing that the windshield, that the effort of attacking the windshield isn't really doing anything. So it's going to scurry up. Oh, look, it goes for Ty, and it's going to attack Ty. That's a 18 to hit. Yeah, he is. 10 piercing damage. Okay. Uh, and is Sanctuary Concentration? It's a bonus is action. It, is, it, is it a Concentration spell, though? No. Okay. Con save with advantage for the poison damage. Okay, I'm sitting at 13 hit points. Plus, you just took 10. Oh, my sheet said 26. You're I mean, at 23. Yeah, you're at okay, 13. Okay, so now I'm at 3, hit, at three points hit points then. Yeah. Oh. There we go. This is fine. Uh, with advantage, that's a 21. Succeed, so it's half damage on the poison. Six reduced to three. But no, I also has resistance to poison. Right, so it's one damage. So you're at two. <laughs> Ooh, this is getting fun. Uh, all right, Jakith. You saw the spider uh, just like yeah, scurry up on the windshield. Yeah, he's gonna follow it. Go to shoot the okay. aim at. <laughs> For it. Oh my god, I'm not rolling well. Uh, 14? 14 just hits. Oh my god. 10d10 lightning damage. <laughs> 36. <laughs> All gone. Alright, he looks around, doesn't hesitate, and just starts going forward. Alright, Billy reloads the cannon. And you all see the tank just go, start going forward again. He's gonna try to steer it out of... No, we're just surrounded by woods, aren't we? Yeah. And you have the coast, like, immediately... Oh, that's right, that's right, yeah. And you, you said, what's the time of day? Um... I know we had the lights on, but I because you're in a dark because forest. Because it's dark, yeah. but we were in the forest. Uh, yeah. One p.m. Okay. Uh, well, should we have a you know, little sit down? You are sitting down on the mega speaker. Let's uh, uh, try to get out of the of the woods at least a little bit. Uh, based on what the map looked like, we're gonna be in these woods for a while. All right, he'll pull the lever to stop it. Okay, it would just, it would take you four hours to get to the town, so the woods isn't gonna be super long because the maps. If you look at the little, if you, I don't know if you can see, but on the map, the measuring thingy was only like three. It's not super big. It's like three miles, and like, yeah, you guys would be. The forest that you're going through section is about six miles. Yeah, but we're also going into a battle. Like, we're. we're... <laughs> we said that we were going through. Yeah. 
in like a, in, a, in about in about three hours or so. I think it's what it's gonna be. So I I, I just figure it's probably six, safe bet to try to get do a little bit of a short rest before we <laughs> jump into a because fucking battle. We'll start to he'll open the hatch, and he'll start to use the the button to do hot chocolate, and he'll start to get out for the others. Right. Yeah, it's seven hours to get to New Furtenberg. That's where we're going. Right. I knew that. Another No, he'll use his mage there. hand. He'll use his mage hand to deliver it to the people at the ballistas. Oh. Okay, so you see uh, cups of hot coffee like floating out the back window. Here you go. Here you go. He'll literally give them to everybody. Thank you. But thank you, Shkid. I didn't fucking get one. Well, you're in here. You can get one yourself. I can't drink anyway. Like at all? I'm wood. At all. That's true. Yeah. And I'm metal. And Ty just like. Okay. <laughs> doesn't do anything for you. <laughs> Jaket is gonna keep an eye out because he was okay. All right. Perception checkers. Only have... attempt to take a short rest. Yeah, I'll let you guys do a short rest. But oh, yeah, perception check. Dirty twenty for give. Uh, you definitely do hear something big walking around and coming in this direction. It'll probably get here in about a bit. God, I'm about a bit. Uh, can you rest and we go? Uh, uh, how about for safety? We get. Under the this little apparatus. So only one medium creature and basically can fit inside the pilot uh, area comfortably. Okay, yeah, like I was saying like underneath. under between the treads under the under the thing. Uh, it's snug to the ground, so there really isn't space under much space underneath it to go underneath comfortably. That's not safe. <laughs> like a tank, you would literally. I mean, have yeah, and like it's like a tank, so there's really no space yeah. underneath it. Oh. Okay. What if uh... Great thinking though? Appreciate and love the ingenuity here. Love it. Is it how dark is it? In the forest, it'd be considered heavily obscured. Okay. What if he turns off the headlights? It, you guys are basically anyone who doesn't have dark vision can't see. Like Anyone who doesn't have dark vision is blinded if the lights are turned off. That's everybody but Hugh. Yeah. Who has dark vision? Hubert has dark vision? No. No, everybody but Hugh has dark vision. I don't. Oh, you don't? Guess well, you're don't in the tank. Vision. You don't have to worry yeah, about it. That's true. I don't. And yeah, he, Ty doesn't have dark vision Wait. either. Am I the only one with dark vision? Yes. Oh, fuck. All right. Uh, Y'all just. <sighs> We'll need to move. He's going to... And, Jaketh, you know that if there's more spiders in this forest, spiders can see in the dark. That's true. Yeah. How... Which way does it sound like this big thing is coming from? The direction you're headed. Fuck. And it doesn't sound happy. Like, you maybe just killed its babies. Oh, God. Not that. Uh... I don't know what to do. I'm stuck. Good thing. It hasn't, it, hasn't been, it hasn't been an hour yet, by the way, so it hasn't been a short okay. rest yet. Cool. Okay. Jaketh is going to... He's going to take... Uh, all right. Y'all stay put. I'm gonna try something crazy. I could do this. He's gonna like, take his cloak. Pull okay, it see over. ya. Billy, you watch the cannon. Uh, he's okay. gonna start to move in the direction of where they're going. You're uh, getting out of the tank? Mm -hmm. 
Okay, so you lever 10 to unseal and open the pilot door. Yeah, the pilot door. Okay, and then Billy closes it. <laughs> Perfect. Uh, he is going to uh, cast jump on himself. Okay. And he is essentially going to start bounding closer and closer, but keeping along the trail, but headed, trying to like cut it off. Okay, uh, stealthily? Yes. Stealth check. Okay. It's with advantage yes. because of my boots. Yes. Don't fail me. 26. 26, all right. So you're bounding, being quiet, and here whatever is yeah. approaching is getting closer. It's probably like a mile out or so, but it's big enough that it's making noise. Oh, fuck. It's that far out. Yeah, but it's big enough that it's making noise, and you can hear like the trees in the distance cracking and toppling. Okay, he is going to, uh, he's going to take his dagger and he's going to slice his hand, mm -hmm. and he's going to smear it on a tree, mm -hmm. and he's going to start going deeper into the woods, and he's going to smear blood. He's trying to divert its attention, and spiders can maybe i don't know smell blood <laughs> i don't know <laughs> he's trying to at least give it the distraction i don't know yeah okay he'll do that all right and then uh he'll get about moving up fast yeah let's go about 90 feet he'll mm -hmm. take an oil flask and he'll take one of the trees He'll spring it all over the oil trap and he'll with his tinderbox start trying to light lighting the, fires. <laughs> he's going to essentially light the base of this tree on fire with his because he has an oil flask. Okay. He has two of them. So with one, he'll do okay. one and then another tree. Okay. Everybody on top of the tank can see a fire get started. He'll take his fingers and he'll try to blow a whistle. <laughs> Okay. Uh, you know, this type of environment is not very restful. <laughs> Pull it ahead and said, I hope they are getting some good rest right now. <laughs> Shit. Uh, as the hour comes in, because this thing is a mile away, and it's, it's not going super fast, it's, it's big, far. so it's knocking trees down and stuff. Everybody does get a short rest. Oh, Jakith will make his way back. All right, Jakith, point. as you're making your way back, Okay. Everybody that's on the tank, you see it before Jakith sees it for sure. Uh, about 150 feet away, crashing through the trees and making its way slowly to where its nest was, is a T Rex sized blue mm. spider. Just. Alright, uh, strap up everyone. Get in. Jakith, as you're walking, you see like a nearby puddle. That's kind of frozen a little. There's like a little bit of ice drifting through it. You see like an impact tremor, like Jurassic Park style. And you Park kind of like size. glance backwards, and you see about <laughs> behind you. I'd say ninety feet behind you mm -hmm. is the T Rex sized blue spider. Just okay. how far away am I from the uh... the tank? Uh, I said it was one hundred and fifty feet away from your friends. It is ninety feet behind you, so sixty feet. Yeah. Are you sprinting to the back Yeah, of the tank? he's going to take, he's going to, okay, so he's going to action, get to the mm -hmm. tank, and as he does, he's going to jump up in the air and almost in a sitting position, he's going to cast Misty Step and Misty Step into the nice. cockpit. Nice. Okay. Uh, this is, everyone's using the same initiative. Just, actually, no, I'll let everybody reel roll initiative. Okay. Hubert's going to be on the tank and not buckled in. Alrighty. All right. Uh, you cannot use the. Uh, in, in the I, I'll read it. I'll read the item. Uh, for the mounted bliss positions, bliss seats outside the tank can swivel 360 degrees and require a creature be strapped in to be used. A creature strapped in is considered grappled. It can undo the straps as an action, but can no longer use the ballista. Aiming and fire, the ballista takes a single action, and only one attack can be used from the ballista. Mm -hmm. So if you're not strapped in, you can't use the ballista. Don't plan on it. All righty. So yeah, everybody can reroll initiative. Everybody, let me know what you got for hit points, by the way. So I can update the tracker. 
Uh, 46. Okay. Anastasia, what are you sitting at? 27. Okay. Ty. 30. Okay. Jakith, I know what you're sitting at. All right, yeah, everybody can re-roll their initiative. So, Jakith, what'd you get for your re-rolled initiative? 18. All right, Hubert. Uh, natural 20 for a 23. All right, Anastasia. 13. Ty. 14. Billy. Last. 11. All right, so Hubert, 150 feet away is this... T-Rex-sized blue spider barreling towards the tank. Cool. Uh, uh, I'm going to post up on the back end uh, okay. of defense and uh, bonus action. Well, hmm. Yeah, you're currently not raging because there was an hour for the short rest. Right, yeah. Yeah, rage only lasts a minute, too, so... Um, Yeah, I guess I'm going to uh, I can't hold my action to rage, correct? You cannot because it's a bonus action to rage. Yeah. Alright. Uh, Alright. I will bonus action rage. Okay. Uh, and then I will hold a heavy crossbow shot for when it gets within range which is 100 feet okay jakith it's 150 feet away currently the cannon has a range of 350 slash 600 perfect crank 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 and aiming it at the uh the face okay taking a shot roll for it as you Thirteen. Thirteen misses. <laughs> and just d- destroys a tree. He'll pull down a lever and this is frustrating. That's both your that's both of your levers, yeah. Yeah. Um Yeah, that's gonna be that's 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 it for him. Okay. It's gonna bring us to the big spider. Uh, it's going to move 30 feet, dash 30 feet, so it moves 60 feet, so it's 90 feet away. So, Hubert, you can fire your crossbow. Natural one. All right. Tie. It is 90 feet away. 90 feet away, and... The ballista has a range of 120. Because you're still strapped. You and Anastasia yeah. are still strapped in. Uh, is gonna looking at that thing and they're going to try to pew okay plus six 15 15 misses that's okay everything's fine uh I guess that's all they can do. All right, at the end of your turn, it's going to use a legendary action to shoot a web at you. It's going to do what? Yeah. Or no, wait, never mind. It's not close enough. It's going to use its legendary action to move up to half its speed, so it moves fifteen feet closer. So it's eighty-five or er, ninety, seventy-five feet. Seventy-five. Yep. Uh, bringing us to Anastasia. It is now seventy-five feet away, getting closer. really need to find a new line of work. This is like this. Is the tank still technically stationary? Yep, it has not been activated to move. Uh, 
and I believe the I'm lights were that. also turned off. Mm -mm. So creatures without dark vision have disadvantage on all their attacks. No, I wouldn't have turned them off. Oh, you didn't turn them off? Okay. Mm -hmm. We're thinking that about was my thought initially. No. Um, I want to say fuck it and not lose my ballista. Okay. Instead, okay. I want to summon the inner clock, the inner workings, and do a little chaos bolt at it. Okay, go for it. And, uh, bring a little chaos to the to the party. No, not an eleven doesn't hit, does it? An eleven does not hit. Besties, we really bungled this one. Hmm. All right. Anything else? You have, your, you have bonus yeah. actions, I imagine, somewhere. They're spells. Okay. Do you need to do any hmm. sorcery point stuff? Good for right now. Okay. Billy reloads cannon. Fires cannon. <laughs> Uh, that's a 15 or 7 plus 8 15 to hit misses uh, the big spider can use a legendary action and half of its movement again so it moves another 15 feet so it goes from 75 to 50 feet away Hubert 50 feet away, huh? Yep. And it is a... Oh, sorry. This is a gargantuan-sized spider, so it's a little bit bigger than a T-Rex. Oh, dear. Uh, heavy crossbow. All right. Pow. That's a 19 to hit. 19 hits. All right. There we go. The big old spider's been hit. Uh, four, eight piercing damage, and seven radiant damage. Alrighty. Because of yep. my rage divine fury. Alright, anything else? No. You get two attacks. But I can't with, uh, because it has the loading property. That's right. Jakith! It's 50 hey. feet away now. Just... <laughs> So only one person shot. It was Ty. Fuck. Yep, and the cannon needs to be reloaded. Yeah. Um, Everything's fine. It's yeah, fine. He's gonna, yeah, he's going to right. reload the and cannon. both cannon shots have missed. Oh. Yeah. Okay, so you reload and you fire. Fire again, yeah. All right. Oh, my God. Uh, 17? 17 hits. Okay. Where you aimed for initially the face. <laughs> Was it 10d10? 10d10, yep. 49. Nice. Lightning damage. <laughs> Alright. Okay. Um, that's, I, I can't really do anything else. That's it. That's going to be it. Alright. Brings it to its turn. It's going to move 30 feet, so it's 20 feet away from the tank. And it's going to shoot a web at Hubert. <laughs> So the web is a 27 to hit. Not hits. So you're restrained. Okay. That's it. Okay. Oh, uh, and you take one cold damage. Okay. Because it's web's ice. Well, not ice, okay. but it's just a cold web. Uh, that's its action to shoot the web. Does not recharge its web. Tie. This thing is 20 feet away from the tank. And the ballista has been reloaded. Has it has been. not been reloaded. It has not been no, reloaded. Not well, it has, it, but it was before, since Incorrect. last time she nope. fired. Only the tank, it? only the can has been reloaded. The ballistas haven't been reloaded. 
Okay. It's all good. Billy used the cannon again. Yeah. All right. It's all good in the hood. Um. So I'm restrained. No, you're not restrained. Hubert's restrained. You're just grappled. Right. So you have zero movement. Oh, I'm just grappled. And it's an action to get out of the. So I could not right now like shoot anything no, with my. No, because Hubert has no ammo. No, no, I meant with my uh, crossbow. You can still use weapons while you're grappled. Yeah, you can still use your crossbow. You just have no movement while grappled. Oh. Yeah. Okay, we can. We can. We can. We can do this. We can. Finagle this bad boy. This might be bad, but uh. No, it's probably. You don't know that. What are you doing? Poison damage? Like, I'm just like, no. it's probably... You don't know. Uh, It's just, uh, Ty is just gonna take their little late crossbow out. Okay. And just, uh, pew. <laughs> okay, make an attack. Twenty-three. Twenty-three hits. Seven damage. All right. That's your action. Uh, I think uh, that's, that's all I can do. All right. It's going to use a legendary action to move up to half its speed, so 15 feet closer. So now it's five feet away from the front of the tank. The Anastasia. Why are we moving? Because <laughs> the tank is turned off for okay. movement. Two, two questions. No, I know, but yeah. Uh, number one. Yep. Uh, how? So it's five feet away from the front of the tank. How far to to its like to the ass end of it? Like to get behind it. Behind the what? The the big the spider that we're fighting uh it's it it's a gargantuan creature so it takes up 5 10 15 20 feet basically so except 20 feet 20 feet long basically yeah so to get behind it would be 25 feet yes and it's an action to oh, unstrap yourself from the seat but hear me out. What if Misty Step? Misty Step would work, yeah. Awesome. So you're Misty Stepping behind it? Yes. Okay, so you I'd Misty like Step just... within five feet of it at its butt. Staying within five feet so I don't you know, get any yeah. attacks. Yep. Yeah. Now, would you get through in the driver's seat? You see Anastasia just appear right you, behind it. If you. But if you use. Uh, a misty step, you wouldn't have to worry about attacks anyway. Get it to that, right? Yeah. Yeah. By the way, I only have 30 feet, so it's not like I'm going too, too far. Okay. Oh, so, misty step. Misty step behind it. Misty step behind it. Mm hmm. Um, and then, everyone else on the tank. Is this what I want to see? Is this what I want to do? You already cast Misty Step. That's my bonus action. Yeah. So that's already been done. So I can't cast a spell. Yes, you can. Unless it's, if it, it's, unless it's a cantrip and it takes an action, yeah. It's a cantrip and it takes an action, or I could do another action. Is this an action? Okay. All right. For right now, I'm gonna take my grand scheme plan will take effect next next one, but everyone on the tank would just see Anastasia begin to just glow with like this celestial light. I know what you're doing. <laughs> and she's just gonna like <sighs> radiant light ten feet. Ten feet dim, yep. Ten feet and radius for bright light, dim for dim, twenty, so yep. 30 feet. Um, 
So at the end of my turn, which is now any creatures within 10 feet of me, including yourself, including myself, yes. I'm going to have to have that spider take some radiant damage. Yep. Three, three radiant damage. Can you also take three radiant damage? That is nice. risk I'm willing to take. It's good. Guys, my brilliant plan is going to take effect next round. Well, now it knows, we'll you're, now well, it knows you're behind it. Well, yeah. Also, the good news is it's like you're also resistant to that radiant damage. So I am. You're right. So you take one radiant damage. Ah. Uh-huh. All right, uh, the end of your is it the end of your turn? Yeah, action bonus action. Yes. It's gonna use a legendary action to turn around and attack you. But wait, that's illegal. No, it's not. <laughs> that's not how uh, and is. it's so big. Uh, it's so big, Anastasia. It looks like it has a reach of ten feet when it goes to bite you. Let alone me. Yeah. So uh, that is a seventeen plus eight to hit. Did you believe that just hit? I would actually. I thought I thought y'all would stay in your weapons. Alrighty, here we go. Weapons well, were doing well, shit no until use, I left. Well, there's no use being in them if we're just sitting ducks and this thing uh, doesn't Anastas- fucking move. Anastasia, you take 15 piercing damage. <laughs> and I need you to make a con save. Besties, I may have bungled this. That That's twelve. You take eighteen poison damage. I'm out, besties. All right. But at least I died. Not a sitting duck. There you go. There's a bonus to it. Billy is gonna do. Was did 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 Keith reload the cannon? Hmm. Jaquette's going to reload the cannon, or Billy's going to reload the cannon and reload the ballistas. The one ballista now that's now being able to, allowed to be used. <laughs> Bringing us back to the top to Hubert. I am restrained. What Correct. am I going to do? Uh, as an action, you can make a strength check to burst the webbing. How far away is this guy? The spider? Mm-hmm. Uh... It's five feet in front of the tank, so it's so it's like ten feet away from me. Yeah, a little bit more like twenty. Wait, you said you went to the back I of was, the tank, so it's like twenty feet away. I, I was on, when I said the back of the tank. That was assuming that it was approaching us from behind. No, it was approaching you from the front. Were we heading away from it though? No, because the tank wasn't moving. To get turned the tank off and got so, out. Okay, so it went. So this thing was chasing us, and then it, and then when we stopped and were resting, it, it went around wasn't cha- and came it up It wasn't to the chasing front. you guys at all. It was coming. It was going in the direction, coming in the direction that you guys were going. Jakith turned the tank off and got out to go scout ahead, and you guys just sat there because no one was steering the tank. I explained that. Okay. A while back, yeah. Yeah. Well, I'm sorry. I, I just assumed that the big spider, big blue spider, was coming from the same place that the little blue spiders were coming from. No, it was coming. And so from I got up ahead. I got confused there. Um, So that was why I did what I did. So um, can I attack the webs? Uh, Yeah. Okay. Be disadvantaged, though, because you're restrained. Great. Uh, Good thing I can reckless. Uh, I'm going to... uh, reckless great weapon master okay <laughs> uh these things uh with the first attack what weapon are you using the glaive okay uh that's a natural 20 so that hits that's great um minus great weapon master to hit, or yeah yeah uh yeah 27 minus 5 22 hits. Yeah, so that's a total of uh, 18 piercing damage plus 10, 28 slashing damage, I mean. All right, the webs are just broken. Okay. And they would have taken some radiant damage too. Anyway, free, I'm going to use my movement to get up on this spider and use my second attack. Okay, you're not going to be grappling it, so if it moves, you're going to be making checks to see if you fall off of it. 
Wait, Unless what? you're, are you getting up on it or are you getting within five feet? I only need to get within 10 feet. Okay. So good. I'll just do that. Okay, cool. Uh, and then I'm going to make an attack. All right. Uh, might as well be reckless. Well, it didn't um, have to be reckless because you did reckless for your first yeah, attack. Yeah, exactly. Uh, so, but I don't know what the AC on this thing is. You don't. So maybe I shouldn't do Great Weapon Master. Yeah, I'll, I'll start it off not doing Great Weapon Master. We'll see how we go. Uh, so with advantage, rolling an attack on it. Uh, that's a 15 to hit. 15 misses. Okay. And you can see Anastasia Super down on the ground duper. dying. Yeah, I can't do anything about that. All right. That's Hubert's <laughs> turn. <laughs> So the spider is going to use a legendary action to do an attack on Hubert, which with advantage because he went reckless. Yeah. And it has ten feet of reach, so that is a fourteen to hit. That misses. All right, uh, Jakith. It's basically like right in front of the tank. All right. Uh, let's try to. Ballistas have been reloaded and the cannon has been reloaded. Perfect. The tank is still turned off removing I mean yeah fucking at this point Anastasia <laughs> no reason to leave her behind uh, he's going to turn it mm -hmm. and aim right right in the center of his forehead alright go for it this is a question Judson yes I can't steady aim this can I <laughs> it is an attack so I'd say you can amazing because that yeah. gives me advantage on this attack Awesome. Uh, does steady aim specify it has to be a weapon or what it has to be? Actually, it says it you give yourself advantage on your next attack roll. Okay, uh, yeah, I'd allow steady turn. I'd allow steady aim for the cannon then. Yeah. Oh, shit, I should have done this before. Sorry. Not guys, sneak attack, was. obviously. Yeah, for yeah, the yeah, cannon, yeah, but a... yeah. Um, it is it. twenty-one to hit. Twenty-one hits. Imagine if a cannon was finesse. <laughs> <laughs> I mean. 62 damage. Okay. It's looking hurt it's now. Just chunks of it are like getting blown off. I mean, it is a raised weapon. Yeah, yeah, that's what I was about to say. Yeah. <laughs> but it's not. But yeah, it's, but it's not. Yeah, 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 yeah I, get it, I get it. I get it. There's really no way to. You're not. You're, uh, with that. Yeah, you're, it's a big tank. <laughs> yeah. Um, But I'm cool with the setting. That's awesome. Uh, yeah. All right. So that was my action. He is going to. He's gonna reload for Billy. Okay. Activating it right now doesn't make any sense because if we start leaving, we'll leave Anastasia behind. Okay. Uh, that's your turn. Yeah. It's gonna use its last legendary action to attack the tank, and it has siege monster, so it deals double damage to objects and structures. So it'll deal double damage to the tank if it hits. <gasps> so it's gonna just start beating the shit out of the tank with its teeth. That is, is this a tank. Oh, sorry. Go ahead. Uh, twenty-two to hit, which hits the or hits the tank by two. Mm -hmm. So double damage would be okay. If this tank gets ruined, guys. Quest is over. We can do something else. There you go. <laughs> All right. Since it does double damage to, to objects, that is thirty-eight piercing damage to the tank. Twenty three hundred twenty. It has three hundred and it has three hundred and fifty fifty hit points. And you said thirty-eight, right? Thirty-eight. Yeah. So 312. And it's immune to poison and poison. psychic, so again, it's an object, can't make a con save against poison. That was the legendary action. Bringing it to the spider's turn. It's going to do one bite on the tank, one bite on Hubert. So the Hubert bite, did he, so does it still be reckless? Advantage because reckless? Yes. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, Always reckless all the time. T 21 to hit. Yeah, it hits. Okay. 21 piercing reduced to 11. All right. And I need a con save. Wouldn't that reduce to 10? Yep. Okay. And a con save? Correct. Con save. 16. So that succeeds, so half poison damage. Eight. 
eight poison damage. That's already been halved. Okay. Uh, the second attack against the, again, then the then the second attack, which is against the tank, which is a th five plus eight, thirteen. Tie. I can see Anastasia taking a little dirt nap. <laughs> Through the spider? Yeah, just. You can like see Anastasia's one like foot. I'm fine, bestie. Seeing... The dirt's real fine. <laughs> Seeing the uh see... it's just gonna go tickle tickle and gonna cast a uh, healing word at the second what's, level. What's the range on healing word? 60 feet okay, as a bonus cool. action. Right. Yep. So you're going to fucking hell, nine healing. All right. That's your act that's death, death bonus action. Bonus action healing word. Your ballista is reloaded. Bonus action. Yep. <clears throat> and we are we are going to give it a big. All right. Let, let's shoot this bad boy. D20 plus six. The fuck did my D20? Guess we're using Leah dice. Oh, that worked. Uh, seventeen plus six. That hits. So roll three. Three d ten to hit. Yeah, three d ten damage. Gross. Sixteen damage. Alrighty. So that's your action bonus action. You have no movement because you're technically grappled. All right. It just had its turn, so it gets its legendary actions back, so it's going to use a legendary action to retaliate and bite. I can't reach you because you're 20 feet away. Um, it's going to bite the tank. Uh, 26 to hit the tank. It does double damage to the tank. Because it's Siege Monster, so that'll be... So the tank takes an additional... 32 damage. Ooh. Um, math. And that'll bring us to Anastasia. You're prone five feet behind this massive spider. Plan A didn't work. Great. Um, might just have to go to Plan B. So, Jakip and Billy inside the tank with it being sealed. Yeah. If there were to be, say, an explosion, how protected would they be? They'd be fully protected. The tank would take fully damage, protected. though. <laughs> yeah, they're... Jakith and Billy have full cover, so they're totally protected from anything outside the tank. How beefy is this tank looking? Uh, it's taken 60, 70 damage and has 350 hit points total. I'm sorry, if you're asking that... And Hubert's, Hubert's basically... <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. No. It's fine. You've known each other for how long? Like three, three days. One. Three days. Two days. Yeah, that's definitely long enough to kill someone. You know, um. That's fine. <laughs> I mean, um. she doesn't want me yapping to tie about anything anyway. So. Right. Like, oh my god! It was the plan all along. There you Shit. go. What's what's Anastasia doing? I'm reading the fine print so I don't fucking kill anybody. She's about to commit a murder. <laughs> Remember, uh, anytime. Oh, wait, does that go away if you fall unconscious? Uh, it lasts for a minute or until I dismiss it as a bonus action. Alright, so yeah, anytime. You, so yeah, when you cast spells, it's going to deal radiant damage and then. Yeah. So is she still glowing? Yes. <laughs> excellent. Not so excellent for me. But besties. So what are you doing? Okay. I don't want to cause a forest fire. But 
And Bernard's not within 10 feet of you, so Bernard's also not getting singed by that radiant damage. Hubert. <laughs> That's what I meant. Same fucking... Same, same thing. Uh, all right. Fireball, let's go. I'm trying to. I'm trying to work it out how I can actually fireball. Just do oh. it. I'll heal everyone. It's fine. No. Channel your inner Hannibal. Channel this, your inner Hannibal. This thing's massive. All you have to do is catch a bit of it, and it does all the damage it would normally do. This uh, thing's massive. All right. All right. All right. So it's a twenty foot radius sphere. Correct. So I'm going to position it twenty feet to its side. Okay. So that it just hits it. Okay. Not me and not the tank. Okay. And I will cast fireball. Okay, so deck save from it. Yes. <laughs> so Jakith. Beside the spider, just a big explosion of fire. Just <laughs> Bernard, you get like a little bit of like soot and singe a little bit. Ty, you get your armor gets like superheated a little bit from the heat. Uh, the deck save. Oh, 18 plus 3. So half damage. Take half, half of the fireball. Mm -hmm. Okay. Please, God, work. And I do have elemental adept I for fire, so. Oh, I was just seeing if ice spiders and that are vulnerable to fire. They are not for some reason. So that is a lot of dice. One landed on top of two. thirty-one damage, so half of thirty-one, mm -hmm. which is fifteen. Fifteen. Mm -hmm. Plus three for radiant damage. Correct. Uh, uh, that would have been five radiant damage because it was a spell. Oh, no, three. yeah, Billy. So that's five. It deals damage. five extra radiant damage plus another three because I'm ending my turn. All right, and then you take one radiant damage. I take one radiant damage as well. And that's within, what, 10 feet? 10 feet. And it's specifically creatures. And Bernard's not I within 10 like feet. I don't like that okay. you're asking. I was just checking if the tank didn't take any of that. Okay. All right. That's everything from you? That is everything It is me. not happy with you specifically after that. So legendary action to do a bite attack on you. Besties. I'm take another dirt nap. It's been great uh, telling you. Man, 23 to hit. Wait, at what point does Sanctuary go away? Uh, what was that before our address? And it was cast an hour ago. Uh, I just remembered we had that. Yeah, yeah last, last that... minute. It's, it's been gone for a hot minute. Uh, all right. 12 piercing Wait. damage. I'm out. Okay. Con save. That is a 23. Succeed, so it's half poison damage, but this is not, this is part of the same attack, so not a failed death save. 18 poison damage reduced to 9, so you're still fine. But you I am fine, I'm just... Making death saves. Again. Again. Uh, but I did a lot of damage, that's everybody. Right. That's right. Be proud of me. Uh, Billy is going to reload cannon and reload ballista. Doesn't want to start the tank and run over Anastasia. No, he could shoot the ballista, or he could shoot the cannon. All right, he's gonna because he because he's been reloading it. I've been shooting it and reloading okay. it, and then so he he'll, shoots it. He'll reload ballista, shoot cannon. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Come on. Fucking three plus eight to hit. Woo! <laughs> Damn it. All right. Uh. End of Billy's turn. The spider gets its second legendary action to do a bite attack. Or this would be a th its third legendary action to do a bite attack. And it's going to do that on the tank. 
because it doesn't like the tank. So. Yeah, and Hubert hasn't done shit to it, so. <laughs> 14 to hit the tank, which doesn't hit the tank. So back to the top to Hubert. Uh, fuck it. All in. Reckless Great Weapon Master. Alrighty. Uh, 12 to hit. Misses. Attack number two. Uh, 19 to hit. 19 hits. All right. For a total of 17 slashing damage and 8 radiant damage. All right, this thing's looking real fucking bad. Pieces of it are, like, full of holes. I think you're gonna wanna look at me. <laughs> All right. Uh, anything oh, else? Oh, I forgot to add two, the two extra damage for the melee attack. Right, so, so another two on top of that. All right. Anything else? Uh, no. Okay. Jakith. This thing's like falling apart almost. <laughs> He's gonna crank it to where it's gonna like Got shoot reload right. the cannon. Oh yeah. He'll reload the cannon. Okay. Shift it around, steady aim, making yep. sure that he's getting right in yep. the. He wants to blast like a hole straight from the face to the ass. Okay. Uh, so nice. Oh, oh, cool. Nice. Twenty-five to hit. Twenty-five hits. Okay. Let's see how much this gets fucked up. Rose dropped out. Hopefully, Rose will be back. 74 lightning damage. <laughs> How do you want to do this? Oh, yeah. He's waiting. And as it goes to make another, like, go for maybe an attack at the tank or at Hubert, he's going to wait till that mouth, like, opens. And as you see, he's just going to release it and just just shoot from, again, just from open maw to ass. Just Okay. The big old spider just <laughs> splits open collapses to the ground. We are still in an initiative order, though, because death saves for Anastasia. Oh, shit. I'm stuck in the tank. <laughs> okay. Well, that's it for me. Okay. Luckily, it's not Rose's turn yet. Ty. Bonus action. Healing word. I just want them awake. Okay. And just, uh... Can I still see their feet? Yeah. <laughs> Once again, just... Tickle, tickle, Anna. Anna, tickle, tickle. And... They will get... Seven points of healing. Alright. So Anastasia comes back from unconsciousness in Death's Door. Oof. Alright. Well... That was terrible. Yeah, it was real bad. <laughs> Should we have a um, meeting about strategy regarding this thing? Uh, sure, if you would like. Uh, yeah, I feel like that could have gone a little better. <laughs> but... We don't, what was it that we were supposed to use these on anyway? Big uh, undead thingies, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, the guy said warped monstrosities. Warped monstrosities. That will be attacking the town of New Furchtenberg. Yeah. Well, I am pretty sure that none of us are going to be in fighting spirits by the time we get there. And this contraption seems to be in a not well-off state. Oh yeah, how many hit points does the tank have right now? Did you get? Uh, 280. Out of 350? All right. And honest, as you, you're back with like six hit points. Seven. Seven hit points. Every hit point counts on that squishy bitch. 
So we could just keep moving, right? Maybe we could have another rest since we're just sitting down on the move. Uh, don't know how well it's got effective it will be on honor. But what are all you thinking on this? Chickas? I mean, I'm going to be honest, I'm I'm perfectly fine. Um <laughs> Yeah, we're okay in here. <laughs> okay, not the point. Um, I mean, do you just want to use it to get where we need to go? Don't we know where uh, that Vic well, Victra lives? I mean, yeah, I mean, we should still help out as soon as we can, but I guess I'm I'm looking for ideas on how we can get everybody up to fight the spirits by the time we get there. Ty. I don't, don't, don't have many spells. I have two. Two total left. Also, just some housekeeping. Jakith, uh, when the door is sealed, the tank is airtight. Uh, it, can hold, it holds air, enough air for 10 hours of breathing when closed, divided by the number of breathing creatures inside. So you've got like nine hours of air left in there. Because Billy doesn't breathe. What if I open the windows? Uh, the windows don't open completely. It's just the, the shutters. Oh, so it's like, oh, that makes sense. Okay. He'll un. Okay. So you seal open. the doors. Okay. So okay. Jakith is driving it like a Jeep with the doors off right now, basically. basically. Yeah. <laughs> okay. He'll, yeah, he'll have it ready, but he'll. There's no like slow movement on this thing, is there? It's just. Nope. It's got its set movement of 30 feet. Should we start moving toward the place and try to figure this out or do we want to wait? Well, Anna, how, how are you? You don't look the best. I'll be honest. You've looked better. How do you uh, feel? Quick housekeeping stuff. Am I still in the dirt? Yeah. Some freaking onto not, the tank. Not yet. You're still you're still on the ground. Am I, mean, I still twenty like, feet away? <laughs> you're still twenty feet away from basically everybody, yeah. Hmm. A part of Jakith hopes yeah. that some of the spider guts blew all over on it as well. Of course they did. Perfect. I Yeah, right now oh, Anastasia. Right now, Anastasia looks like they're on that Nickelodeon show where you get slimed. Has it been a minute? Yes. Am I still glowing? No. Okay. I will glow once more with prestidigitation and just clean right. everything off. All right. So I do not have any spider guts on me. Excellent. I'm just going to sit there for a hot second and just be like, you know, I've been in worse positions in my life. Really? Um, mm -hmm. Well, you are a tough cookie. Usually, I don't end up almost dead. Usually, that works for me, but um, guess not. So, I have to rethink my plans here. Yeah, because as it stands, you're going to have a hell of a scar right there. 
from what? What? From what? What am I? What is scarring? Like other than like mentally? There's a fang in your body. <laughs> Went right in, right there. Yeah, the fangs like this big around. You know, I wasn't like present for that, so ah. Uh, <laughs> oh, quick reminder. <laughs> definitely happened oh wait yeah and as it's, as it's being talked about the magical healing that tied into you kind of just slowly closes the wound and pops the fang out that is disgusting but also i'm gonna keep this thing this is a beautiful thing go for it it weighs uh about three pounds oh xavier with ty ty yeah 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 yes do you think Baron Ivan would love this fang if I gave it like as like a peace offering between the two of us? I think you 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 should try, Anna. Like he's really into hunting, so I feel like if I brought him like, hey, I hunted this, he might like accept me more. You're going to l l l l lie. Well, it's not really a lie because, like, we technically did hunt it, and it's like a trophy, you know. Anna, what would Miss Key you say to you saying that? It's not a lie, like. Oh, I mean, yeah, she not a lie. She helped kill the thing. So I helped I think kill the is, thing and we took a trophy. It's quite literally a trophy of her exploits. It is a violent, violent trophy. And you're I going think. to explain to me, 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 You're going to explain to Miss Q how you almost died twice from it? I mean, I figured that you would tell her and then I would just ask for forgiveness later but if Ty had eyebrows they would be rubbing them right now okay just but. think that Bear and Ivan would love this and by extension love me so right so pardon me for not like knowing exactly how you work but does that mean you don't need a rest? Me? Yeah. Oh no, I 100% need a rest. Yeah, all right. You do need your be 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 beauty sleep. Hey, Ty. Hey, yes, Ty. Uh -huh. Now, what did I tell you about that? That you love me and all of my little quirks. What does this mean? Is it this means fuck for you. Friends? You want to procreate with Ty? Oh my god. You cannot be that dense. Like, genuinely, you cannot be that nah, dense. he's pretty dense. I can swear like, it. Dense like stone. Yeah, dense like stone. I'm pretty fleshy. The kiss. Hey, it is a versatile word. Uh, you kind of have to take it at the tone with which it's set, whether or not it is a positive or a negative. Okay, like. But so, it's not like, say, a finger is a finger. So in your, where you're from, mm -hmm. how would you say like? Um, God, I can't even like just begin to describe how you would say it without saying it, but like, mm -hmm. it's like a curse, you know, like not a, a yeah. curse curse, but like a curse word, yeah. like an how expletive. Would, yeah, how would you wish ill on someone without actually cursing them, just with a word, right? You would, well, wishing ill depends on how you wish to wish ill, I mean, like one-on-one -on -one uh, combat until one is dead is typically how it's done like no no like if i said i hope 
you choke on your dinner. That I would is find the a same... way to make you choke on your dinner. Yeah, yeah. But if I were to say that, I hope you choke on your dinner. That's about a saying. That's about like saying, get fucked. I feel like he's really just missing the mark here. Yeah, not and... literal. Well, a lot of what your people do and what my people do is probably vastly different. You know, if you wish to engage in procreation and mating, then do that. If you wish for someone to choke on their dinner, then you, you know, make them choke on their dinner. Wishing ill is not something we do if that's what you're getting at wow JK mm -hmm. I live in kind of a sketchy part of Golden State so that's all we do is we just wish to ill upon each other and it's almost like a way of saying like fight me you know that you should fight it is a I easier... would love to fight Ty but Miss Q would be so mad you see Billy pull his ears off Yeah, all right. Hi. Ty, Ty, Ty. I am Ty. It's going to do the crank to start moving. All right. <laughs> going to reload the ballistas. Anastasia, how are you getting into wait, the tank wait. while it's moving? Wait. <laughs> Run her <laughs> over, bitch. Oh. Ah. Slow down. Don't Stop worry, me. Anastasia. I'm Anastasia. 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 I fixed it. I fixed it. It's a, it's a, uh, oh. The stars, yeah, you know? I'm I'm faster than this tank. So I can keep up. If can needed. someone help me onto the tank. Yeah, here you go. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh to throw Anastasia twenty feet in the air on top of the tank, athletics check. Wait, the tank is twenty feet high? Yeah, I said that last session. Oh Heber could do it, like, he's the barbarian. Yeah. Twenty feet. Yeah, that's why you, you guys were hitting. That's why you guys were hitting like the branches w when you were sitting on top. Right. Uh, what would you want me to roll? Athletics check. Okay. That's a sixteen. Anastasia, Sazia. Sazia. You just land on the top of the tank. Oh. Thank you. Much appreciated. Really love. Really yeah. love that. <laughs> Problem. And he'll clamber up. Okay. Thanks. And he'll start to go again. All right. As you start to go again, the next seven hours to get to New Furchtenberg is boring, but because it takes seven hours, you do arrive at the point where you will need a long rest should you choose to take it. You're about an hour outside of the city at this point, going down dirt roads now, or ice roads. You're no longer in the forest. Ice road trucking, baby. Basically, yeah. We could uh, set up camp on top of the this thing and sleep in turns, if that's yeah. smart. Or, I think Anna Anna should sleep in the in the tank. Respectfully, no. Okay. I don't need well, to sleep. I can watch you all sleep. It's fine. I don't need, need, to need to sleep. No. <laughs> Anna, could you just sleep in the tank? It'll be make sure that you're safe, secure, and not going to die. I'm not going to die. Like, despite what my track record shows, I am not yeah. a you... delicate little flower yeah. that Did... needs to be encaged to you be kiss. protected. Yeah, you see that back there? She's made of stone of stuff. She's dense. Ah. Yeah, up here. Makes sense now. I am not dense. You're made of tough stones. You are dense. It's a good thing. Yes? <laughs> no. Saying no. someone's dense in my culture. I thought we already like talked saying, about this. Is saying that they are an idiot. Oh, well, you're not dumb. It's 
so I am not dense. But she's oh, no. hard. But I'm also not hard. Hard of mind. Stubborn. <laughs> hard headed, yes. Power yeah. down the uh, treads. Okay. And he's going to and open the hatch and cake climb to out. like the bottom of the treads, just because it's funny. Nice. Or the the spider bits, because you just would have just Perfect. steamed all of, just oh, yeah. drove over the spider. It's all like crushed under the tank and just caked to the treads. And because it's cold outside, the... all the guts that have like frozen to the treads. It's just popsicles. He's gonna power uh, off the lights. Like... <laughs> Break off. And yeah, it, this would be uh, 9 p.m., so it is dark. And he will uh, take out his hooded lantern, light it. Or 8 p.m. Set it on the kind of in the middle area. And he will take his cloak and he will bundle it around himself and pull his oh, yeah, kind of like. It's cold as fuck outside. <laughs> ball himself up. As much as possible. Okay. Anna. Hi. Go into the 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 the, the cockpit up there and sleep. Nah. No. Anna. No. Shouldn't force I'll people to do things they don't want to do. I'll 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 tell Miss In... Q what really happened to her porcelain figurine. In the name of Alibol, I will get into the cockpit and sleep well. See, right. I can't go in the cockpit. Hubert's already it, in there. It has been a long time since I have been able to properly worship my deity. So I will go do that. Hey. Hi, Billy. Yeah. What was that? What Billy was just like, hey, so I said hi to him, but also like, do you have a deity? Yeah, Alibor, not for real. Isn't that your 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 kid? No, <laughs> Annabelle is my yeah, daughter. Did you name your kid after your deity? No, the only similarity is that they both start with an A. You, like, you said them the exact same. Are you sure she's not dense? Just In the way that you mean it. Just special. And me and Mama Cute, Miss Cute, Miss Cute, Miss Cute, love will, her dearly. I will recognize that you have indeed found uh, that it has the same mouth feel. <laughs> Alibar. And Annabelle. Yeah, it's like the exact same word you're saying. Yeah, it's, you're I, it saying sounds exactly, exactly the same to me. Like you are saying the exact same word twice. Yeah, uh, well, <laughs> they're not the same, but that's fine. I mean, I would have said it's sweet that you named your they, daughter after someone that means so much to you. They both mean the world to me. But I wish my parents would look back. Yep. Well, don't freeze. <laughs> He's gonna get. <laughs> don't <into> freeze. This. <laughs> if you He's close the door, just the if you close the door, just remember you get ten hours of air because it comes airtight in there. Yeah. All right. <laughs> all right. <laughs> I can just stay up all night. I can't. I don't sleep. Thanks. So you guys don't need to keep watch. Okay. Get yeah, this already snoring, sleeping. And, yeah, it's probably Billy, not snoring. Billy just has the knife between his teeth and he's looking around. That's so unsettling. Go to sleep. Rockabye babies on the treetops. Hey, Billy. <laughs> So, you want to play a fun little game? The only game I play is jugular slicing. Do you want to play a fun little game? What game? 
go into the cockpit and hide. And then like, I can't. The door is closed. The oh God damn it! And also, well, yeah, yeah. You should have hidden in there and I then hidden, and, and then like in the middle of the night. Yeah, like like just spook the hell out of him. I mean, you could do it to your kid. I'm sure he wouldn't mind. You two seem to be, like great friends. We developed a very close bond. I bet you two are very close, and you did so well working together in that cockpit. Do I think, need... like, as a little, like, mm. show of friendship, you should spook him awake halfway through the night. Why? I just think he would really appreciate it. Would you appreciate it if someone did it to you? Well, yeah, probably. Noted. Don't do it to me, though. Like, you said you'd appreciate it. I need my it. beauty sleep. Yeah, but, like, also, this is strange times we're under, so maybe not tonight. Maybe in the future, but like not tonight, because you gotta do it to kid first. What's beauty sleep? Restorative sleep, you know? Nope. You also don't sleep, so I wouldn't expect you to understand. Anyways, good night. Night, Ty. Um, don't fall off the tank. Ty just looks at Anna and just like, how would I f -f -f fall? Like, don't get into any shit while I'm asleep. And Anna will go to bed. Okay. Uh, as a part of his, I guess, worship, he's going, uh, Hubert is going to get out his um, brewer supplies mm -hmm. and kind of pray for inspiration okay uh in that regard not in the game I understand rule sense but um he's gonna kind of pray for guidance in that regard so that he can kind of bring the the uh the joy of inebriation to many people uh uh, through Alabal. Okay. Eventually, those of you who sleep find sleep. Jakith, what does Jakith dream about? Muted. That is an interesting question. I like to think Jakith dreams about seeing returning to the astral plane and uh, you know being in the astral plane again not here okay what does Anastasia dream about Well, it starts off dreaming about her fiance, and Ooh. then it turns into how much shit would go down if Ty found out they had a soul. Yeah. It turns into a nightmare. <laughs> okay. What does Hubert dream about? Uh, hmm. I don't know. You'd think that he might dream about the things that he worries on, but oddly, no. Um, I think he probably has a just a dream that could just be a memory. Like, it's just fairly standard day at uh, um, uh, the Flying Bodice. Okay. Fairly standard day. Okay. So it's a, it's like, it's not a memory, but it's like, it's one of those things that, it's one of those dreams that kind of induces, uh, 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 deja vu at a later date. Okay. Because it's just so close yeah. to 
what you normally experience. Okay. Um, Ty. Even though you go inert, Warforged are still classified as humanoids. What does Ty dream about? Ty would be... Because you dream, just... Because Ty's aware dream. of their surroundings, so... Correct, but you can still dream. There is a phenomenon where people dream while they're technically awake. Just because you're a warfare doesn't mean you can't dream. You're so humanoid. Oh, this is weird. Oh, this is weird. Uh, I guess Ty would just, uh... Probably almost, like, going back through the memories with, like, Anna and, like, Miss Q. Probably, like, that kind of thing. Okay. Jakith. Roll me percentile dice. Um, 46 46 you're in the astral sea just kind of hanging out doing whatever you do there <clears throat> there you are and, and in your dream there's an entity floating kind of in the astral sea as well pale skin gaunt face spikes just impaled through the entirety of the skull long black flowing like leather cloak almost sleeveless the arms are also covered in these spikes glowing red eyes and he says i found you now to find your friends ty are only percentile dice Fifteen. Fifteen. you're dreaming about Running through the whatever the orphanage, I guess if that's where y'all are from, with Miss Q and Anna, and then out of nowhere, Miss Q and Anna both kind of go still as blood begins to pool out of their mouths, and two blades pierce through their back and out of their stomach. And standing behind them is the same figure that Jakith saw: the spiked, gaunt, red eyes, long leather cloak. As they both fall to the ground, Deddy's like, "Found you as well." Anna, roll percentile dice. Four. You're with your fiance. Doing fiance things. And if anyone has seen the original Friday the 13th, anyone here? There's a scene where Kevin Bacon's lying on the bed. And you're, oh no, you're looking at your fiance as you come back from out of your doing. He's laying there. And then out of nowhere, from under the bed, a blade through his throat from under the bed. And then he's thrown off the bed, and the bed's thrown aside, and the same individual that everyone has seen in their dreams so far stands up and goes, Found you too, Anna. Hubert, roll percentile dice. <laughs> 62. You have a great dream. <laughs> nice. However... Well, you all do gain the benefits of a long rest. But... <sighs> Who do I want to pick? Anna, roll me percentile dice, please. As you all wake up and you can see standing on the tank, even Hubert can see through the back window, is the individual you all saw in your dreams. Minus Hubert. Hubert didn't see this guy in his dreams, but he's there because he at least saw half the party in the dreams. And he just says, I found you all. Let's do this again, shall we? And Anna, roll me a d100. Oh, fuck. 50. Okay. As you all wake up, one by one, you can feel that same sensation, the same tugging sensation where you were pulled into another plane from your dreams. Billy is also getting pulled in as well. But what's strange is, for some reason, so is the tank. <laughs> Iconic. And as you start swirling through this void space, this vortex between the planes, not knowing where you're going to end up, 
got to end the session there this week because I got to go to bed early. So. No. Yeah. The tank's coming with you. That's a good spot to end it. So is Billy, because he's sentient. Uh, Billy May's here. We're going to pick up there next week. And because he found you, the guy found you, got sent to another plane of existence. Because this is going to be a short campaign. Level up. To oh. six. Oh, Yay. But uh, good night, everybody. Yeah.